Welcome back, this is Bellar Scooper with more Let's Play Xenosaga Episode 3, The Story So Far. Xion witnessed the two anti-gnosis weapons at the public demonstration battle held at the Consolidated Advanced Technology Testing Ground. One was the Interstellar Strategic Integrated Weapon System, Omega Res Novae, and the other was the humanoid weapon system, Telos, who bore a startling resemblance to Cosmos. Xion reunited with Yuli after the demonstration, and as the two talked, a mysterious boy named Abel appeared. Abel drew a picture of Nephilim and left, leaving Xion with a strange impression toward him. Current objective, head to the Vector Research Wing to see Cosmos and the members of Vector's First Division. We're going to get a little bit of a homecoming today. We are still joined by Xion, still in her uh, Vector outfit. It's probably time to take that off though to be honest with you let's go ahead and, and change that to uh the dive teddy which is actually a web or uh an armor for Xion, surprisingly uh a lot better in a lot of aspects uh than the vector uniform so already i'm kind of like eh, maybe the vector uniform isn't that great and that's what i got for completing the second game so already not looking too good. All right, dive Teddy is on. Teddy, I believe, the refers to delay. something similar to like a All personnel involved to be honest with you, I'm not that up to date on women's fashions. All right, board the transporter. Indeed, I will. Let's head further into the cat testing ground. I do like their cars. Those things look awesome. The exercise area. It would make parallel parking so much easier. Well, that's all I'm saying. Committee member Mizrahi informed us that you'd be coming. Nevertheless, this is Section 7, so please refrain from imprudent behavior. The area past Section 7 could be called the true development area for the integrated weapon system. Even we security force the members have to submit to a strict body search before going on shift. And I assume afterwards, as, well, no, they're not worried that you'll leak hangar. stuff out, just that you'll bring stuff in. Okay. It looks like Omega still needs adjustment. It does, Elias. The pilot is having trouble, right? The risk is too high to deploy it against the Gnosis. Honestly, it just the fired in random directions, so, closed. you know, if it's surrounded, it'll be fine. All personnel involved should head Did to you the hear the hangar. news about the Panarian star system? The Gnosis got to it, right? Yeah, that's been happening a lot lately. It's only a matter of time before they reach this planet. I wonder if the integrated weapon system will make it in time. The yeah. exercise area will they can be come attacking any time. Can the Gnosis make it here? I guess that is a question. Probably can. They warp, don't they? Wait. This is a VX-7000. I haven't seen one of these since the first game. It's because of the Gnosis terrorism. Since we don't know when or where they'll attack, at least it looks like an eggs to me. The top brass is leaving nothing to chance. I see. Vector's participating too, so I guess it's only natural. Vector's involved in everything. Does it bring back memories? Well, yeah. What else brings back memories? Apparently All nothing. Is there, can I look at these closer? No. Fair enough. We will continue on. Hey, you doing, buddy? Who the hell are you? No civilians besides those affiliated with Vector are permitted past this point. You're with Vector? I apologize. If you're looking for the joint research facility, it's two blocks ahead. All right, we will keep going. Then. Uh, there's nothing really else going on around here in terms of treasure or anything like that. Just. Feel free to continue forward. Oh, aren't you the one who used to be the K-Pax de development chief? Was I? Too bad about the mock battle today, and I really mean that. That new, well, that new android seems kind of sinister, you know? See, even she is a fan of Cosmos over Telos. Can I actually go to these guys? No. I didn't think so. I have giant doors, though. How you doing? There was a way down there. There's a lot of stuff about Telos's development that even we haven't been told. 
To begin with, that Roth Mantel guy who's in charge All of development, how did he wind up working here? I don't even know who he is. That's kind of important. Why do we have to change angles in order to see that? Weird. All right, uh, let's actually head down here. I don't believe it actually leads to anything all that important. Yeah, it leads to the sealed off chest. The There's a red button on it. Doesn't seem like Supervisors I can do anything. And then it's sealed off over here as well. I wonder if that means anything. And then we can't go that way? It looks like we should be able to have gone down there. Eh, I guess not. We will continue on then. Mm, the area below here, it's section 9. All phases of the it's used entirely for transporting in materials for the research for war. It's also used as a passageway during emergencies. I've just noticed, why are all the guards guys? And technically all the workers have been guys, too. Sexist. Anyway, we will continue on. All hey, you're Vector, Ted. Huh? Is that you, Chief Azuki? You know me. Everyone's down below. They're a bit depressed about the re results of today's mock battle. They really shouldn't be. You know, Omega got a lucky shot, Cosmos kicked the crap out of it, and then lost. Hmm, I've seen your face somewhere before. All phases of the performance I know, you're the person in the over. photo on Chief Allen's desk, so you're the former chief? The yes, I am the former chief. I'm above him. Welcome to the research ward. Board the elevator here to reach Vector's laboratory. They seem somewhat frantic. Maybe it's because of the mock battle today. Mind you, that section's always disorganized and frantic ever since I All left. I'm not even going to try to say your over. name. Supervisors French to me. Murtaugh. Murtaugh? Before I was assigned to security here, I was assigned to security in the special weapons development sector, and I'm slightly too old for this shit. It's not a place you can go normally, but I heard there's another Omega All there that was developed separately from the current Omega. Supervisors for each Proto, possibly? Alright, we will continue on. All possibly, oh, almost down the elevator. Supervisors for if you take that elevator down, you can go to Vector's Laboratory. Room. What's below that? What are you talking about? I've never heard of anything further down. Why would I ask? That seems like a weird thing. How are you doing, Evita? Do you miss Argentina? I get nervous when that girl from Vector is here. Miyuki. Oh, I don't mean that I don't get along with her or anything. For each weapon are then who's in the that room. girl from Vector? Anything over here? Passage to Section 9 is currently locked. Uh, no need for me to say. We will just continue on. Move to Vector 2nd R&D Division Lab. Indeed, I will. All I think it's time for a homecoming. Or at least a reunion. Not necessarily a homecoming since it's a place of work, but still, a reunion nonetheless. What's with these passageways? Like they put the, the only door there and then they just kept building? Seems weird. We've been doing that a lot around here. That's wasteful. Chief! Togashi. Welcome back, Chief. They're all talking to Chion. She's not the chief anymore. Alan's the chief. I'm glad everyone is looking well. Too bad about what happened down there. Yeah, you guys sucked. What the hell's your problem? If I was handling Cosmos, I would have gone fine. Well, considering what she was fighting, I think she did a pretty good job. That's why you'll never make chief, Togashi. Yes, you're right. How silly of me to assume that you were competent. By the way, could you stop calling me Chief? I don't work here anymore. Yeah, and it's very awkward when you're saying that in front of the current Chief. No matter where you go or what you become, you're still our dear Chief. Poor, poor Alan. Right, Chief Ridgely? Huh? Oh, uh, well, yeah. See, I mean, it's sad. She gets called Chief and he gets Chief with a qualifier. Not cool. <laughs> Thanks, guys. No, don't don't encourage this kind of behavior, Xion. Where's Cosmos? Recovering, I assume. She got beat up pretty badly, so she's undergoing maintenance. I thought that was pretty obvious. Cosmos, 
You're still doing your best. She might have been able to do better. Looked like she was only doing an episode two style X Buster. If she had done an episode one style one, that thing would have died. But what am I doing? That's a good question, Xion. What are you doing? What would you think of me if you saw me now? Xion, you are not wearing adequate protection. Chief. Mm -hmm. I guess you're concerned about Cosmos. She is standing over it, staring at it, so yeah, probably. Oh, it's not that. I... It is that. After seeing Cosmos and everyone, I just feel like you've all left me behind. You left them behind? What are you talking about? That's all. Chief. Oh, now you're making Alan feel bad. Damn it, Xion. I'm sorry. I think I'll be going. Thanks for everything today. Don't come to my hotel room. You know, it would just be awkward yet again. Chief, um, tomorrow. Whoa, that is an angry looking Alan. Hmm? Tomorrow, uh, would you like to go out for a bite in the city? Yeah, how do you like your eggs in the morning, Xion? Unfertilized. I found this great restaurant the other day and... They do sell eggs. Sure, sounds good. Like, is there any other restaurant here besides Cafe Stream? Yeah, I figured you'd be busy. And well, maybe next time. Alan, so used to rejection. Wait! I said sure. She doesn't even miss a beat. She expected that, apparently. Uh, what? You got to, like, first base for you, Alan. A meeting. R really? Yeah, when would be a good time? I'm free all day. As soon as you wake up. Ah, um, okay. Let's meet in the hotel lobby at 7 p.m. Whoa, 7 p.m.? Like, she's free all day, dude. I'll come get you. Is that like, do you have work? Put it off, you finally got a date, dude. Okay, I'll be waiting. Yeah, we'll see about that. Thank you. See you then. Good night. Good wow. night. He sounds like he just got sugar for the first time. Did you see that slow walk, Alan? She was flirting with you via walk. Excuse me. Ah, oh, this guy. Is this the Cosmos maintenance room? I just want to see what kind of damage I did. It's smaller scale than I expected. I'm better than you. Special Advisor Roth Mantel? Why are you here? Did you come to gloat to the losers? Yeah, go Togashi, I'm finally on your side. Calm down, Togashi. Alan's not, though. I apologize. What can we do for you? Oh, that's quite all right. What he said isn't exactly wrong. I came here to gloat. Excuse me? I mean, I came here to finish off the losers. Wait, what? I need you to gather your things together at once. How are you in charge of firing all these people? Wait a minute. What about Cosmos's repairs? Really? There's no need. I, he just fired you all and you're like, wait, I'm not done repairing. Yeah, he's firing you. Cosmos is being canceled here. Cosmos will never awaken again. What the hell? Do you know how much work I put into Cosmos? You're telling me I can't use her anymore? What are you talking? This will explain it. Do you know how long it took me just to get her swimsuit? What? Decision to dispose of Cosmos? Dispose? Like, to Xion? Because that's what happened with the ES. What the hell is this? And why is he delivering it? 
It's exactly what it says. The subcommittee voted on the decision a short while ago. Why didn't they send an email or a phone call? Hey, we're gonna have a meeting about this. You're all fired. There is no need for us to waste our resources. Oh, fuck you, dude. So we're pouring it all into Telos's development. You didn't even have a Telos versus Cosmos off. You know, like, how do you know Telos is better? I'm sorry, but I'm afraid she's going to be scrapped. Why does she need to be scrapped anyway? She's clearly effective. She might not be the most effective, but she's effective. I can't believe it. How could they scrap Cosmos? That is a good question, Alan. You're a little late to the party, though. I beat you to it. Seriously. You saw Cosmos throughout two games just utterly kick Gnosis ass, and they're finally like, no, we got something better, so destroy it. Let's see, I suppose I'll return to the hotel for now. Indeed, that is uh, what we want to do. Despite the music, what's with the music? All phases of the performance program hey, I heard the demonstration at the fourth performance grounds is over. Yeah, I heard that too. Apparently they even used captured Gnosis. You yeah, destroyed a lot of those. Oh, what's you? How was the demonstration? I don't want to hear about it myself. They may be captive, but I'll still pass and coming face to face with Gnosis. Shouldn't that have been like recorded? You know, with like multiple angles for us to view later on and study the footage of so we can, you know, fine tune it a little bit. No? Fair enough. Just head up. I'm looking for more people because they do say something new, I believe. Man, using captured gnosis for experiments, I never understand what's going on at the top. Apparently they hold gnosis in a solidified state using something called a Hilbert cage. But who knows when that device might break down, you know? Hey, some kind of explanation. They do have some sort of Hilbert cage, some sort of energy field that they All can't penetrate. So there you go. Some kind of answer as to how they can capture Gnosis. What? The there was a special demonstration at the fourth performance ground? No one told me anything that big was going down. Can I do this, like, not even facing him? I can. Oh, I turn around. If, I, if it was at the fourth performance grounds, did they use captured Gnosis too? See, he's in on this. He All knows what's going on around here. 